This is just a quick teardown of a Cisco ASA5520 firewall. Already done a little bit of tearing down. Um, the faceplate is just a little snap-on piece. Not too much to see under the cover. Basically, from what I can tell, this is just nothing more than a custom PC motherboard. Under the main heat sink, you have a old socket 478 Intel Celeron processor. It would be interesting to see if a person could put something faster in here, but I'm guessing the kernel is compiled specifically for this processor. Looks like it's just a basic 2 gigahertz Celeron. I would assume that under this heat sink is a chipset of some sort, but I, it's too small to can't really tell like what the labeling is and stuff. This particular one has two sticks of memory in it that I believe should be 256 megabytes each. There we go. Yeah, 256 megabyte DDR memory. Under the uh, heat sinks there should be the network adapter chips. And then they had to put the uh, CF card slot on a riser with a ribbon cable just so it would be oops, clearance for it to be the secondary slot to be accessible externally. And this particular one was configured to be exhaust out the front. I believe normally these are mounted backwards essentially, but this one had the, the rack ears on the front, so a little bit different. But yeah, not too much to see. Pretty simple inside. Just a single board. It'd be interesting to see what would happen if you were to try to upgrade this. Maybe put some more RAM in it. I don't know what, what this processor would support for RAM. Um, this is ECC DDR memory. So, I'm trying to think. I think you can get up to two gig sticks and uh, or DDR ECC memory. Whether the CPU can handle that or not, that'd be a whole other question. But yeah. Also, this does have a um, expansion port for um, add-on module. But thanks for watching.